Affirmative. We will erase football. Get up. I won't let you erase football! <laughs> Heavenly Horse Arch Pegasus! Gammon! I'm literally expecting, like, a lot of customers in again today. Oh, we're going to get pretty busy for sure. Right. Well, if we're all set, it'd be rad if you could start with... Gammon? Are you there? Typical. He would slope off just as we were about to open. That's, like, so not cool. Huh? Where'd this mic come from? If you would be so kind... Oh! Like, sure! Leave it to me, mysterious dudes! Player data from both teams has been implanted into this man's brain. He will provide commentary on the match. We hear that commentary is a vital part of the football experience. Yeah, I guess. We have registered our team name as Protocol Omega. Your team name remains unclear, however. Haha, <laughs> this was a bit of an improvisation, so we haven't thought of a name yet. Hmm, let's see. How about... The Sherwins! This team is for you, after all. I think it fits really well. The show wins. <laughs> oh, and you'll be needing this. Huh? The captain's armband? Yes, you are the captain, right? Get your boards waxed, because the protocol Omega versus the show wins match is about to begin. Time to stop this child's play. Let's wipe them out. <laughs> Sovereign of the skies, bang wins! Armify!
A foregone conclusion.
is alpha. Affirmative. Huh? Roger, we'll comply as ordered. What is it? The timeline interrupt we carried out earlier on Arian Sherwind has been rendered ineffective. What? How could that be? They must have interfered. Time, by its very nature, strives to return to its original path. A reconverged flow will be far more difficult to interrupt a second time. This match is over. Play AX3! It's coming! I'll stop this one too! Be able to get 
We've got to make sure Mark creates the football club. We can't lose this match. The future of football rests on Ryman Football Club. about letting me play? Victor? Huh? <coughs> Victor! You came! Huh? You're not Victor? No, I'm not Victor. But you weren't far off. I'm his older brother, Vladimir Blade.
can armor fine! Here goes! Heavenly Horse Art Pegasus! Really did it! I armified my fighting spirit! Mm. How did they manage that? Great! How does it feel? Power's welling up inside me. I feel like I could do almost anything. Let's do it! Okay! Your orders? Withdraw. Roger. What? What's going on? We're abandoning the match. Ha-ha! <laughs> we did it! Mark's going to be able to create the football club! We preserved the timeline, Arion! That means we won! We did it! What a day! We've got Vladimir to thank for all this. 
Yeah, but before we celebrate, I'd like to hear his story.
My work here is done. But... Huh? What's happening? The interrupt in the true timeline has finally been repaired. Vladimir will vanish along with the parallel world he came from. Looks like time's up. Uh, uh, uh. Thank you.
I am Fay. Fay Rune. And all I want to do is protect football from you! Total! Oh, oh, wait a minute! It looks like the match officials are going to abandon the match! Yes, this international friendly has been abandoned! What a disgraceful display! A disgrace for both our country and for the sport itself! Too gruesome! The American team are all injured! Could this Japanese team really have been chosen to represent the nation to the world? What a shame for Japan! Mind control mode. What? I think that about wraps up this interrupt, don't you? All your passion for football will now be wiped away! You will never defy El Dorado again. What's that light? Faith, you are a dangerous individual. Therefore, your existence will now be compressed for storage. <gasps> what, what? Once you have been compressed into the storage dimension, you'll be easily searchable in our database. <gasps> Everyone hurry! Get out of here! It's no use! We just can't defeat them with our powers as they are now! Quickly, go! Okay. Everyone, this way! Dr. Cryptix! Let's move, team! Come on! Get on board! What should we do, boss? Are we really just gonna let them get away? Hmm. Beta, change of target. Compress Mark Evans. Yes, Chairman. Everybody's on board. Coach, come quickly. Okay. Ugh. Coach! No, stay back. Don't come any closer. Stay back. <laughs> Coach. Coach oh, Evans! Arian, wait. You can't help Coach Evans now. <laughs> we must leave. <gasps> Aw, they got away! No matter. We've compressed Mark Evans, so we've done what we were told.
for now, we've got to concentrate on winning this match. The path to victory lies in 3D. 3D? space between your opponents. Don't just use the pitch. You have to use the space in the air, too. The air. Now I get it. Everyone, follow my lead.
what's that power? How are you able to do that? <laughs> and you thought that you could beat us. They've been holding back this whole time. <laughs> we wanted you to think we were weak. As for you, Master, it's time for you to be erased. Just like they did Coach Evans! What? Come! Loose! No! Not on your life! Stop! He's holding back with the force of his will! A crystal? What have they done? This is the end of football! The teachings of the Master are now ours! <laughs>
Dorigo, what kind of play do you call that? I am sorely disappointed. One of the principles of war is knowing when to move and when to be still. When to attack, and when to defend. Ah. I know now. I know what I have to do. I have to keep watch over what's going on on the pitch at all times to lead the team to victory.
Excellent. Good on you, boy. With Lord Uda's power, there's no time to serve that can stop you. Poor play, even for you. Huh? Eh, Beta? I'm not even sure why Eldorado hired you. 
Who's that? Uh, get out! Teleport mode. What are you doing here? Gamma, bring her in. Ultra smart. It was about time. Protocol Omega 2.0 is in dire need of a version upgrade. Gamma, you stuck up little... Now, now, mind your manners. Come, we can't keep the chairman waiting. Wait! Hi! What about giving us Coach Evans back? Very good foresight to have transferred Evans in advance. <laughs> well, we'd already allowed for Beta's unstable elements. You're going to prove very useful to us, Coach Evans. This chronostone is Mark Evans? Incredible.
Aitor was right. I was so jealous. Just because Rick is always so much better than me. Joan! Can you hear me? Gabby? I know what I have to do now! I'm not supposed to be the leader. I'm not made to be in front of everyone. I need to support them so they can attack and win. And you know what you have to do. They need you! But I... I can't! What use am I? I don't even know if it was really God that spoke to me! You can't doubt yourself now! I don't doubt you! I believe you! As long as you believe, then everyone else will believe too! And then follow you! Yes! Fighting spirit! Many
yourself! Trust your own eyes and ears! But... I... I just can't! I can't believe in myself anymore! But you're right! I have to! Perhaps I am not destined to be a fierce knight, but I can lead my people to victory with my knowledge! I can raise their spirits and give them courage! Hear me, fellow warriors! Put fire in your hearts and believe in our victory! We must have courage! For God is on our side! And by this flag, I promise you, this day we will prevail! That's the spirit! It's time! Let's get this Mixy-Max done and dusted! Soji, are you ready? Wait a second!
The most important thing is never to hesitate in the middle of the action. You can't predict the future or what direction the ball will come from. That's fine. It's fine to make a snap decision and leave it to chance. JP, you want to protect the things that are important to you. You can't let them slip away for want of a single second of time. I understand.
You did it! I did! Thank you so much for your advice! Please proceed as per the agreement! We're on our way! Watch out, Jugali Yang! He's a funny man, but I think his words are sort of inspiring. No doubt about that. But he's afraid of it. How fascinating.
I won't! I won't let it end here! Huh? Whoa! Is that a dragon? Whoa, whoa, whoa there! Somebody call the Surf Patrol, cause this dragon is Mondo, not a nature! I knew it! Jugliang is a dragon! I'm not so sure. Look! That's a fighting spirit! It's a manifestation of a strong heart! So that's what it is. Yep. Wow! Juga Liang is a spirit summoner. Feel the power surging through me. <laughs> so this is what Mixy Maxing feels like. <gasps> that was an enforced Mixy Max. I didn't even think anyone was capable of that. Juga, I must thank you for agreeing to lend us your strength. I wouldn't bother. It wasn't for you. Using him was simply the most efficient way of rekindling my own spark. Well, even so, you did us a favor. All right. Time to turn this around and seize victory. Yes, coach. A mixy match with Juga Liang? Well, come on, then. Let's see it in action. I'm going to use your power to win this match and save football.
JP, stand up! This battle isn't over yet! Are you telling me you're giving up? No! But I can't save these goals! I just can't! Even I can't defeat Tao Tao as just one man! You have friends to support you! With friends like Guan Yu and Zhang Fei, I've been able to save so many of the people of China. They brought me to where I am now. And when there is a cause to fight for, I never let anything get in my way. I would even do the impossible. I need to save people. That's what keeps me going. It's the reason I'm alive. That's so noble. We need to build a strong country for the sake of the people who live in it. And I won't give up on that. You know what I mean, don't you, JP? I know you do. You've come this far. Do you really think you can just walk away now? No, I can't. You're right. If I give up now, I'm giving up on football. I faced strong players before and won. If I lost football, I'd... I'd lose myself. I can't turn my back on that. Liu Bei, I won't let you down. That's the spirit. His resolve is true. Liu Bei has roused him with words alone. Liu Bei is right! I can save any goal they shoot at me! I'll protect the goal with my life! Wonderbot, we can get that mix and match sorted now, can't we? I rather think so. JP, together we can stop any ball. Now, protect that goal. I will! Is there something wrong with him?
to me what is this power I'm out of control does my greatness know no limits you've finally started to understand what the hyper-evolved children are and who are you supposed to be that's the Shogun I am honored that you would grant me this audience. Don't stand on ceremony. Tell me what you wanted me to know and make it brief. Yes, sir. To cut a long story short, I wish to open up Japan to the rest of the world. Meaning? Meaning? I wish to restore the rule of the Emperor. The Emperor? But isn't he... The Shogun ruled in the name of the Emperor during this period. Ryoma wants to cut out a middleman. Keeping the country closed to the outside isn't working. We can't sustain it. To create a truly great society, an equal society, we need to learn from the rest of the world. We can't sit here and wait to be attacked. If we show them what we've got, we'll be respected instead of invaded. An equal society? Samurai becoming farmers? Farmers becoming samurai? <laughs> A country bumpkin like you would suggest that. Country bumpkin? Oh. Commander Kondo, come here. Okita! Huh. As commander of the Shinsengumi, what do you think of Sakamoto's proposals? Looks like we're too late to stop him from brainwashing the Shogun. So this whole thing was a trap. Well, what do you think? <laughs> I think I've got a good idea. Field creation mode. Akita, 
If you're going to risk your life in this fight, I won't hesitate to oppose you with all of my strength! <laughs> Them's fighting words!
Akita, he's telling the truth. You must understand it. Japan is stagnating under the Shogunate. Preserving it is only delaying the inevitable. I know you understand it, but you still turn a blind eye and uphold the Shogun. Killing me won't change anything. A dithering here shut away from the world definitely won't change anything. What? We... Are you saying we were wrong? But we can't be. Even if you are wrong, can't you do the right thing now that you know? People make mistakes. It's how they react that's important. What difference does it make to me now? I can't do anything about it. So what? You're just going to give up? I know how you feel. But I know someone who never gave up, even when there was no hope. I respect him more than anyone else in the world. But I'm a member of the Shinsengumi. My job is to defend the Shogunate. Okita, please lend me your strength. With your help, I'll be able to defend something that's really important to me. Do you mean? Okita, I pledge to serve Japan. To protect the future of the country, Japan is irreplaceable to me. It's the most important thing in the world, and so I must defend it when called. Your life is not dedicated to me, but to the Shinsengumi, to the Shogun, to the future of Japan. Together, we will defend Japan! Yes, Commander. That's what the Commander said. That the Shinsengumi was created to defend what's important. If you're telling the truth, then... All right. I'll trust you. I'll give you my strength. You've finally seen the light. I feel like I finally understand what the most important thing is. It's what I've been chasing after all this time. I may not have much time left, but I'll dedicate everything I have to this cause. We're not gonna get a better opportunity than this. Let's mix him ax Akita and Victor. Fight, Zanuck. Not we invited folks. Huh? It's 
takes a great man to help his enemy. That sounds like a Miximax invitation to me. Roma and Rioma, get ready! Roma has proven himself worthy. Fingers crossed it should work this time. I'm already there! Riomas, grace yourselves! Dog learned a new trick, huh? Let's test it out.
What's going on? That guy seemed to really want that stone. And that power of mine. I don't like it. <laughs> Figures, you don't understand what you're truly capable of with those powers. Excuse me? <laughs> you don't know anything about me and my powers. <laughs> On the contrary, I'm blessed with pretty much the same talents as you. What do you mean? Welcome, friend. Starting today, you get to be a part of New Gen. Deportation 
mode. Field creation mode. Objective complete. to do now, Big. Let's do this. Together.
more power tucked away that you aren't using. You need to look to the future yourself, just like you told Big to. Faye, I know you can use fighting spirits and armify. If there was ever a time to use them, it's now. How do you know that? What's holding you back, Faye? What is it? I... I can't. Faye, answer me! Why won't you use your fighting spirit? Why won't you fight with your full strength? Dad is not coming back. Maybe he gave you to me because he was going to leave me alone. It brings back painful memories, opens up old wounds. But Sarabi is a really powerful fighting spirit, Faye. And he's pretty cute, too. How can he make you think of bad things? Goldie, how could you possibly know about him? We're all giving it everything we've got for the sake of the team. Me, Fake, everyone. We're all your friends, Faye. We're giving it our all so we can protect football. Protect football? Are you starting to get it now? Come on, show us all what you can do. I... My fighting spirit. What was I thinking? Everyone's out there, giving it everything they have, and I'm holding back. I know what to do now, Goldie. It's time to make a stand, like Big and everyone else on the team. Here I go! Grrrah! Whoa! What's this? Faerune unleashes a totally bodacious bunny bro! Where'd he pull that from? You did it, Faye! You summoned your fighting spirit! Him out cold. If I'm not mistaken, conditions could be just right for a you know what. Faye, Big, get yourselves ready. Mickey Max, activate!
you don't mind me saying, you two look tickled pink by all this football. I'd say you're ripe for a Mixie Max. Get ready, Saw. Huh? Mixie Max! Activate!
your corn at Argos. Mm. Sir, this is Simeon Ape, the ringleader of the hyper-evolved children. Oh, Gramps, you remembered me. Maybe I should be flattered. This is absurd, leading children in a war against the entire world. <laughs> absurd? I don't think so, old man. Otherwise, you wouldn't have tried so hard to wipe us out. It was football that caused our hyper-evolution. That's why you've been trying to tear it out of the timeline, no? To be fair, that's pretty lame, isn't it, old man? Uh. So what if we're children? Why should that make a difference? Starting from now, we're going to follow the laws of nature. The strong survive. The weak perish. Chairman Argos, sorry to have kept you waiting. Huh? King Arthur! Well met! Are you the youths who aspire to my round table? You must prove yourself in the Knight's Trial. First, you must meet the pride of our realm. Knights of the Round Table, come hither! We are the Knights of the Round Table! If you think you have what it takes to join us, then we will test you in open combat! No! But, but the Knights, it's Rymon! Valiant youths, prithee your name. Your Majesty, this is Faerun, and I'm Arian Sherwood. Verily, those are noble-sounding names. There is always a place for a worthy knight at my round table. Sherwin, Rune, you will set yourselves in battle against the flower of English chivalry. My knights of the round table, show courage. Thank you, Your Majesty. Very well. Let the trial begin. By my decree, today's trial will be... Football. Football? How come? The time jump. When the parallel world was created, it must have also inserted our concept of football into the story. So, we're going to take everyone on at football. Prepare thyselves for the trial, would be Ricardo's a Knight of the Round Table!
Concentrate!
stay in control. A wise and learned queen of dragons, why do you work such mischief in the land? Do you no longer love the people? I entreat you to remember, August Queen. Remember that you are possessed of a wise and noble spirit. Your Majesty! Queen of Dragons, you must heed my words. If you do not... Wait, wait! She's a nice dragon! Really she is! This I understand. And with this blade, I will cleave from her the darkness which afflicts her. Your Majesty, be careful! Ha! I heed not your warning, Cyril. This opportunity for me to display my power as Sovereign Ruler must not be squandered. I am Arthur of Camelot, your king! He's going to... Queen of Dragons, I can hear your pain in those cries. I've come to release you from that pain with the power of my sacred blade, Excalibur! Disengaging practice mode. Initiating hyperdrive mode.
Go. Continue battle. to get the better of those perfect cascade droids. But I've got to do it somehow. I have to protect Faye. Queen of Dragons! You're back to your old self again! Goldie, there is something that you feel you must protect at all costs, is there not? This is why you fight so fiercely. You... you know? Yes. Even though you hide it, I can see that you carry a boundless love within your heart. But if all you have is love and tenderness, you can't protect the things that you hold most dear. If you want to protect that which you love, you need both strength and insight. Strength and insight? You need strength to stand up to the forces that threaten what you love. And you need insight to understand the wounded heart of the person you love. If you have both of those things, you can protect that which is most important and let your love for it flourish. I think I understand. I want to show my respect for your pure heart. 
So I'm going to grant you my power. I bestow upon you a dragon's ferocity, but also vast wisdom and intelligence. You must use both powers only for good. By the looks of you, you've mixy-maxed with the Queen of Dragons! Amazing! That's right! The Queen of Dragons gave me her power! Thank you, Your Majesty! Just you wait and see! I'm going to use this power to protect the thing that I care about the most! Sir Arian, from what I can see, you aren't suited to giving orders on the field of battle. You don't have that art of leadership. But this is not what is truly needed to become what is called a leader of men. It's not? What a true king needs is spirit, an energy like yours. The spirit that hearkens to the voices of the people and takes on their sufferings as its own. This is a true gift, Sir Ari. The gift weaves together the power of the people and forges it into a nation. And a nation can resist even the most powerful foe. Can that really happen? You support us through thick and thin, but that isn't your only strength. Mm. You have immovable courage, Sir Ari. Immovable courage? Unshakable power. I can see that within you, something kingly resides. You have what it takes. Something which the people can believe in and trust. You have the makings of a true king. Me? A king? Wonderbot now! Miximax Arian and King Arthur! What? With Arian? King Arthur's recognized Arian as a king! What more do you need a welcome, Matt? Right you are! Let's go!
We were defeated. Does not compute. Roger. Defeat confirmed. We will make our withdrawal. At last! We defeated Perfect Cascade! Arion, we defeated Eldorado's most powerful agents! This is incredible! Yeah! <laughs> that pretty much makes us the Ultima Eleven already! I've said it a thousand times. The true power of football doesn't live in any one player. It's something that comes about when there's a harmony between the talents of every player on the pitch. Each and every one of you must be ready, or the Ultimate Eleven will not be able to unleash their full strength. Yeah, probably have said that a thousand times. But we did it, guys! Was some display, Arion. Your pro material. Who are you? <gasps> Look! He looks just like Arion! <laughs> You're not the first to say it. My name is Simeon Ape, but I'll let you call me Simeon. Simeon? I came here today to tell you all something. Yeah? What's that? It's very important. It's about you, and it's about us, too. Truth is, we're... Rude! Looks like they got to them before me. No biggie. Now, my name's Gammon 
Checker, and I'll be cooking up an ultra bodacious commentary for you today. Welcome to the beginning of what might be the end of the world, Ragnarok! The champions walk home with the rights to rule the entire planet, and to start off the apocalypse, the Battle of the Norse Warriors! Whoa! Gnarly twist, right? The smaller warrior won out in the end! Look at them, getting all excited over nothing. <laughs> So, he went ahead with it after all. Remind me, what exactly is the point of all this? There is no point. He's just playing with him, toying with his prey. Me, I'd go straight for the jugular. Huh? Desmodus! Wolfram! I haven't seen you in monkey's years. Can you please not butt in right now? If you don't like it, you should have said something before. A fabulous rebuttal. You are quite right, of course. Beloved Simeon, I do feel that we share a deep bond between us, but we are still so very different. You'll forgive me for being a little shy. In the meantime, I was working my claws off with my own little project. You're not the only one with a plan, you know. We may drop by to watch your little game, if we're so inclined. Put on a good show for us now, won't you? <laughs> oh, those two. I can't stay angry at them. Well then, it's time. Raise the curtains for humanity's final act. Ragnarok! <sighs>
getting stronger?
Bark like chihuahuas. Well, I used to bite like a pit bull, but now the strongest nobody in existence barks, bites, claws, and tears like nothing on this planet. Mix and match, Zanuck Ultra. Well, what do you think? This is what happens when you tackle a hurricane and win! The man's gone nuts! Completely balmy! Plebeians! Turn your heads this way! It's time for Zanuck Avalonic's brand new special move! Grr. the crowd. Feast your eyes on this! I am the Almighty! Ultra! Go! It'll be fine. Whoa! What do you say to that, Gramps? Say it! Yes, it's there! I can sense the power of the Eleven! You are indeed the all-round player, who can pierce any defense with raging fire and quaking thunder. <laughs> I knew you'd say that.
got to test you to make sure you're ready to come back to us. I understand. Ah! What? Ah! What is this? My head feels like it's about to split apart. Goodness me, no! He's using telekinetic waves! What? One of the hyper-evolved children's powers? Unfortunately so. It puts great pressure on the target's head. If this goes on, it'll put the whole team out of commission. Uh, oh, Faith, please, stop this. This isn't... Before. Do you really want to end it like this? Uh, Arion, you're... Keep going, Faye. They could never understand. You know this. They aren't like us. They're the enemy. You're my enemy! Don't listen to him, Faye! What? what? Benefactor X? No. Sorry, but I can't stand here idly and let you take the coward's way out. Faye, stop this right now! Would you kindly shut up? You know what you have to do, Faye. No! You don't have to listen to him! I... I...
it's almost time. Shall we get going, Arian? Right. Tell me. How did we end up in this mess again? I still don't really believe it either. But we made it this far. There's only a pretty bit left to go. It's not just about football anymore. We're fighting to save the whole bleeding world. Booyah! What a rush, eh? So explode with excitement like Big Volcano! Ah! We'll show them just how good we are. I knew you'd say that. All of you. This is it. This is the one match we can't afford to lose. Arion! Yay! Hey! How's it going? It's Coach Evan! Coach Evan! Coach Evans, welcome back. I'm... I'm so happy. What's the matter? You look like you've seen a ghost. Play just like you always have. And I know you'll pull through. Isn't that right, Arian? Oh, Coach, this is wonderful. It feels like rhyming back together. But how? Sorry, guys. Hope you weren't too worried about me. Faye here managed to help me out. He helped me escape. As a stone, I didn't really have a leg to stand on. But how did you get back to normal? <laughs> that indeed is the million credit question. Reverting a person from a chrono stone back to their original form happens to be about as challenging as your average Sunday crossword. Well, bully for you. I got stuck on last week's. I asked Dr. Cryptics last night to turn Coach Evans back to normal. I didn't know if he'd be back in time for today, so I didn't want to get your hopes up. Sorry for keeping that secret. And so that's what we were doing yesterday. So Mr. Evans can go back to normal too. Me? I'm perfectly fine like this. Let me wait till the match is over before I go back to my decrepit old self. Well, if you're sure. So, are you going to coach us today, Coach Evans? Right you are, Ricardo. I'm with you all the way. Really? Yay! Everything feels like it's falling into place now. Yeah! And just in time for the final battle! Right, everyone, let's play football! Yeah! I'll let you get yourselves ready for the final battle. Best of luck, guys! I'd still be here, dudes, but here we are at the start of the extra round of the awful and awesome Ragnarok Tournament! The future of our world will finally be decided tonight, so brace yourself for the biggest waves you've ever seen! It's time for Kickoff! An extra special match calls for an extra special stage, I think.
grown-ups in El Dorado are part of the old world. They treated us like monsters. But people like us, we're the new world. We'll erase the old one and reset everything. We'll start a new world order and create our very own utopia. We won't give up. We need our future. Supposed to be human? They are better. They're human beings just like us. And that means even they can lose. Assuming we can win. <laughs> now, what do you think changed? You got three guesses. Gen can do.
How can they be on equal footing with us? We are hyper-evolved children. We are the strongest team in the world because of the gift we all share. <laughs> Special powers don't make a team strong. It's the thoughts and feelings of every player working together that's important. Liar! Our powers give us worth. We're a billion times more important than those old men. And it's our powers that bring us together as new gen. I finally understand now. Simeon, listen to me. New gen doesn't exist because everyone has superpowers. It's because we're all sad, lonely children. We were all outcasts, and new gen was our refuge. That's the only thing that's keeping it together. No! You're a liar, Faye. We are the next evolutionary step. New Gen will herald a new era. The strong can survive without relying on grown-ups. On anyone. That's why we are strong. But what's the point of living on strength alone without anyone to help you? That sounds awful. I'm sorry. I don't know how to explain it, but... That's not what makes a team. You have to be burning with passion and overflowing with tears and, and dancing with happiness and, and all these things together. Together? Together. That's what makes a real team. You have to make friends. And if you do, you'll make an unbreakable bond that'll last forever. He's right. We may have traveled through time and space to become the ultimate Eleven, but the most important part was the journey itself and what we gained from it. The bond of friendship. Uh... I was alone like you, but after traveling with Arion and his friends, I don't feel alone anymore. They're like a family to me now. We're not alone. We're special. Connected by our power. We don't have to be friends to be new gen. It shouldn't matter whether you have powers or not. We should treat each other as equals. No. We're special. We're gifted.
I don't know if I can last much longer. What's the matter, guys? Have you forgotten? Remember how you always play. The Rhymon way. The Rhymon way. Ha! I've told you the most important thing in football often enough. The most important thing? Uh, what was that again? If you work together as one and go up against your opponent with everything you've got, then you're sure to win. Even if you're the strongest in your own right, it doesn't mean zip if you can't work together. I think we've all witnessed that. What really counts in a team is harmony. When all players work in unison, you can achieve perfection. That's right. We're a team. Even if every player on their team is stronger than us, together we're stronger than they'll ever be. We're the Ultimate Eleven.
and a team. It certainly is not. What? It's not over till it's over, right, Simeon? Exactly. Like you're our leader. We know you can pull off miracles. Oh, uh, I'm a lost cause, you guys. Don't bother. Not true. We just need a little more time. We can still win. Come on. We can do this together. Uh, but why would you? Why'd you think we would, dummy? We fought together all this time. Yeah! After all we've done, you're not allowed to give up. Just give the order, and we'll follow you. Same as always. Besides, we can't quit here, can we? But... You don't want to let it end here, do you? Are you, like, just gonna give up? No. I won't. We'll fight them. Together. To the end. I swear. I never even realized. They were so right. I guess we weren't just a team because of our powers. We shared our battles together. We stood up against our fate and fought to live on. We can still fight, together, as a team.
team have saved football and the future of mankind too yeah yeah but that's not all they've made Rymon a force to be reckoned with we lost but wasn't it totally fun you're right we hyper evolved children have always thought that we were different the next step but in fact we're just the same we faced our equals and we lost fair and square that's all there is to it. But that's the least of it. Arion and his team have taught us a lesson. That we're not just some kind of organization. That we're friends. Friends? Now that's a word I've so never even used. Friends, huh? Oh. Uh -huh. Simeon. Arion. <sighs> Thank you. No problem. Arion. Consider calling me a friend. What are you talking about, Simeon? There's no need for that. Friends aren't something you pick and choose. Becoming friends just happens while you're not even thinking about it. So before you know it, they're important to you. That's... friendship? Yeah, and that's why we're already friends, you see? <laughs> Oh, Simeon. He's not exactly filling me with pride right now. You win. We'll honor our word and let Eldorado get rid of our powers. That's great! Football's going to be really happy about this! What do you mean? Well, this means you'll get to live much longer now, so you get to have lots of fun playing football! Yeah, I, I guess. I hope football lives on. In your time, and even in the future's future. You can make all sorts of friends through football. Friends you never even knew you had. So I hope you keep playing. Haha, <laughs> you would say that. Alright, sure. Great! You should go. Don't keep your team waiting. Okay. He's back! He's back! Phew. I must admit, I was growing rather fond of that crystal. You helped us out again, Grandad. <laughs> what can I say? I do anything for football. Of course. It means everything to you, doesn't it? Only about as much as it means to a certain grandson of mine. <laughs> You've got that right. Mark, I'll have to return to my own time after this. But I know football will be safe in your hands. Carry on my legacy, will you? Show the world what our football's all about. 
I will. I promise. Well, Mark, I'll be off now. Nice seeing you again. You too, Grandad. Traveled through history and met some really amazing people. But now our journey was at an end. I don't know if we really were good enough to be the ultimate eleven. But there's one thing I'm sure of. The friends we made through football were without a doubt the greatest friends of all time! Hyper-evolved children are an example of what humanity will one day become. Is it really right for us to deny their existence? I don't know, but what I can say for certain is that the burden they carry today is too great for them. But tomorrow, perhaps not. When the time is ripe for the rest of humanity to take that step with them, I don't think that any one of us will be able to stop it. Ha! Too true! Too true. <laughs> We've got to go now. We have to return to our own errors. Yeah. So this is goodbye, Arion. It was really fun meeting you, Faye, and going on adventures and playing football with all of you. I knew you'd say that. I feel the same. So this is it? It's all a little bit sad. Something come out of so nose. This is so sad. Take care. We won't ever forget any of you. Mm. Mm. Thank you all. I won't either. I don't think I could forget you. I'll have so many wonderful memories playing alongside you. Safe trip. Goodbye, Faye. Okay, let's go. This time we've got a bright new future waiting for us. Yeah, let's go. I wonder if our adventure was all just a dream. Our unbelievable journey through time and space. If it was a dream, I won't forget it. Because we made some true friends. Do you know me? Oh, lovely to see you again. It won't be long before I give birth to baby Faye. Yeah, I know. But you... Won't be able to be your mother. I know. You'll take a turn for the worse after I'm born. Yes, but it's all right. Because we got to meet again. I guess. Besides, we changed history once before. I'll do my very best to meet my little baby. Goldie, I'll resist my fate and create a new timeline. Easy peasy. Well, goodbye, Mom. Okay. Faye, take care, sweetheart. I will. <laughs>